fresh. Are those plums? I think they must have picked them in somebody's backyard. And that French butcher, yes. he's still charging Paris prices. Is that music coming from my... Huh? Did you leave your door unlocked? Hey, Millie! You forgot something. Boy, oh boy. Did you forget? Hi, Millie. Hello, Bert. I, uh, I found the door unlocked, so I just came in and waited. I'm glad it was unlocked. You are? Well, I... I wouldn't want you climbing through one of the windows. Some of the neighbors might not understand. Well, I think I, I would attract less attention coming through the window than I did coming through that squeaking door. Gosh, you sure look nice, Millie. Oh, I stole this for you from your garden. Thank you for the flower and for the compliment. You always were a very gracious flower thief. You like the new record I got you? Very much. Isn't it strange how that lovely song reminds me of chicken salad? You know, we never did dance together. Thanks for the record. Time since I saw you. One month. One whole month. Thirty days. Thirty-one days. You dance nice, Millie. So soft and warm. Did I say something wrong? No, it's just that we were forgetting to dance. Don't be so frightened, Millie. I'm not. Or if I am, it's because I want to be. N not frightened. Just a little careful, cautious. What's new with you? Eat, sleep, go to the movies. Oh, I got myself a job at Hathaway's department store. I've already been promoted as section manager. Oh, Bert, that's wonderful. At this rate, you'll soon be president. Then you won't have any promotions to look forward to. When did all this happen? Today. Today? Then what are you doing here? You should be out celebrating. Well, I, I was kind of hoping we could celebrate it together. I see. No, you don't see. Yes, I do. Bert, in, in some way, you feel obligated to me. I know what I feel. Because I was company for you when you were alone. But with your new job, you don't have to be alone anymore. That's all over. Millie, I, I've met a lot of people, but I'm still lonely. I've been seeing people uh, Are you sure you're meeting live people? Well, they walk and they talk. Oh, Millie, I, I followed your advice. I went out on dates. I just found that young people are too young for me. That's all. I took out a girl from Lady Sportswear. Found out she was secretly in love with Gregory Peck. She had his autograph, so we sat and stared at it for one whole evening, like some mystic ceremony. Now, can you picture that? Yes, of course. You see, I'm in love with Gregory Peck, too. Matter of fact, I resent this girl's interfering with my secret love. Yeah, well, you can joke about it. And there was that girl from uh, Accessories and Leather Goods. I took her out, too. Ha! Oh, it couldn't be that bad. It was worse. She was a bubblegum addict. She was a what? A bubblegum addict. While we're dancing, she's popping that gum in my ear. 
as long as she danced well. Now nah, she was a jitterbug. Oh, I adore them. Jitterbugs can be fun. Yeah, but with bubblegum popping in your ear? Well, it depends upon her sense of rhythm. Oh, Millie, don't laugh at me. I tried, honestly, I did. And there were a lot more on the list, too. Why go through it? I just didn't enjoy myself with them, that's all. Oh, Millie. You wouldn't want me to spend the rest of my life with a bubblegum addict. Would you, Millie? Sorry, I goofed. <laughs> you goofed? Hey, man, that's bop talk. Where'd you ever pick that up? Oh, why shouldn't I pick up an expression here and there? I'm not that old. Bert, what did you really come here for? To ask you to dinner and a movie. A dinner and a movie. Just to celebrate my new job. Okay. 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 <laughs> 